Dominic Thiem downs injury hit Alexander Zverev to reach third consecutive French Open semi-final. Dominic Thiem advanced to the semi-finals of the French Open for the third year in a row as Alexander Zverev's battling work in previous rounds finally caught up with him. The Austrian was beaten by eventual champions Novak Djokovic and Rafael Nadal in his last two appearances in the last four but will hope to go at least one step further this time around with a meeting with the Serb once again on the cards. Thiem is the only man to beat Nadal on clay over the past two years, recording victories in Rome last season and in Madrid in 2018 and his latest run at Roland Garros confirms his status as one of the very best on this surface, although his 6-4-6-2-6-1 win over the German was heavily influenced by the world number no. three's physical woes. For second seeds Verev, it was a day of real disappointment. Having fought his way through three five-set matches on the spin to reach the first Grand Slam quarterfinal of his career, his body finally let him down. Though it was brave to fight until the end, there will no doubt be concerns as to whether he'll be able to compete at Wimbledon in less than a month's time. His team will hope he hasn't aggravated the problem further by continuing. A left hamstring problem started affecting him as early as the third game in the match and by the end of the second set his mobility was seriously inhibited. And having suffered defeat to the 21-year-old German just a month ago, Thiem exacted his revenge to reach the Final Four. After some early jostling, it was Thiem who broke first. The Austrian thumped a trademark cross-court one-handed backhand winner from deep with fearsome velocity and it skidded agonizingly off the line beyond the helpless German. A thumping 135 miles per hour race out wide wrapped up a one-set lead for the 24-year-old, who looked assured and dominant on serve. Zverev, on the other hand, was struggling to find the zip in his game and he sent a backhand slice well wide as Thiem broke for a 2-1 lead in the second. Gripping his hamstring. There were fears that his physical exploit in the previous rounds were catching up on him. Thiem had clearly caught on and started to utilize the drop shot and although Zverev was still showing plenty of pace and desire around the court, he was in some discomfort. A double break soon followed and Zverev received a heavy dose of strapping from the trainer around the troublesome left leg. With the atmosphere flattened and the German clearly struggling to find motivation, Thiem wrapped up the second set. Zverev hobbled off the court at the end of the second, but he did manage to resume the third, even in the knowledge he would require a five-set win to advance. The chance of him advancing became even less likely as Thiem broke with a backhand passing shot up the line at the start of the third and Zverev's race was effectively run. And with the youngster barely able to move, Thiem made no mistake to book his spot in the semi-finals. In the simultaneous women's quarter-final on Suzanne Lingelin, Madison Keys reached the semi-finals of the French Open for the first time in her career. The 2017 U.S. Open runner-up beat Yulia Putinsva 7-6, 7-5, 6-4 to advance to the last four. The American is yet to drop a set in Paris and will either meet Russia's Daria Kasatkina or compatriot and close friend Sloane Stevens for a rematch of last year's U.S. Open final.